How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video on my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing a filter because that one is not cutting it for me. It is so loud, it doesn't function properly, and I'm just really over it. So, I stopped by PetSmart today and grabbed this new internal canister filter that has a little promises on its box. I'll show you. It is the same brand as that filter, so I hope this is good. But it's a Marine Land internal canister filter. It filters 290 gallons per hour. It's for up to 97 gallon aquariums. It's only 10 inches big too. And it has powerful three stage filtration. It sits in the tank like that. But I'm gonna have it up in the corner. You guys could look at that too. All right, so here you have the filter. Let's crack it open. All right, so this is the actual body of the filter. It's really small. It's like 10.5 inches, I think it said on the box. The water comes out this way and it goes in through here. And it has suction cups, I'm pretty sure. It's probably what's inside this white box. Oh wait, we have instructions, but come on, who needs that? I'm just kidding. 100% read your instructions, you need these. All right, oh, we have some other goodies. Oh, a whole little container of activated carbon. Heck yeah. Yeah, all that other good stuff to actually mount this in your aquarium. Now in this white box, I am not sure what we have. I don't know why it has two openings though. Oh. Oh, you could reuse this if you clean it properly. Oh, this thing just came out of it. How about, I think we should read the instructions and how to set this up. So that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, so what you wanna do, <clears throat> you're gonna want to unscrew the lid and then you want to pop this out and then you unscrew it and you're supposed to pour this inside of here it says i'm not sure how much it says to pour hmm i guess i'm just going to fill it up three-fourths of the way let's go ahead and do that oh that filled up more than i thought um okay i just filled it up all the way that's fine. Let's screw it all back on. Okay, something just fell off the bottom. Oh, that was just that. This whole setup is mainly for water polishing and that is pretty much that is just to get the maximum amount of clarity in your fish tank. So if your water is really cloudy or whatever, then you just use this and your tank should be crystal clear the next day. But this is the main filtration. So if you need a filter, if this is gonna be your main filter, this is what you need. I already put my carbon inside. Um, you just gotta plop it back inside. And then you just gotta twist it back on. Boom, just like that done it looks like a blender <laughs> okay so there's this little piece and then you snap this into the two holes on the side like right there and then you take this and you just slide it right on there so it looks kind of like a I don't know and then for these three suction cups with these little flap things the flat end on the back you just want to slide in these suction cups just like so boom you just gotta work your way in there and then it'll end up like that. And you just wanna do the same thing for these other two cups. I got all three in there. And in the tank, it's gonna sit like that against the wall. That's a tank wall. And it's gonna be like that on the inside. So to connect it, you have to slide this little back plate into here. So basically it's gonna look like that. And there's like, it's just the weight of it, the weight of the filter is gonna hold it in place. It doesn't click or anything. So it's just like that. So let's go ahead and just stop messing around and put this thing in the water. Keep these cable ties because we're gonna need them later to reorganize our wires so it doesn't look as messy.
is a powerful filter. Look at that. Look at that filter grill. That is just one heck of a filter. I just took out the entire filter and realized it was a recording, so sorry I didn't get it, but. Oh, this is like a few hours later. Just got done editing the video up until this point, but it's so overexposed, I hate my phone. Anyways, the filter, if you hear a hum, that's just from the air pump, but this filter is so quiet, it's insane. It's major clutch. Because when you have a filter in your room, or in general, you don't really want it to be loud. But you can't really win in everything, but I think I won this one. I think this filter's quiet. I think I just got some peace. Look at it. It's running pretty well. And it, look, it even has like a little current going up here, which is really good so we don't have any static water at all. And if you do get a filter for any fish tank, I really do recommend getting an air pump. Your fish will love it. It's oxygen fish need oxygen <laughs> if you didn't believe me the current in this tank from this filter is insane here's a clip it's like having a jet do you see that the water is just chilling up there it's all from the filter and when i was like feeling the pressure earlier in the video putting my hand in front of it it felt kind of like a really low power pool jet which is good and i definitely say if you don't know this already do not put any like discus or like anything like that don't put any angelfish like still water fish around this filter because this is a strong filter made for like predatory fish i'd say they need more flow but like for discus and i don't know why you would ever need this for a beta fish but you get the point bad swimmers cannot take the flow but it's overall a really good filter so far. I'm really loving it. It's minimal. I'm a little upset that it takes space in the tank, but it still looks really cool and really sick. And uh, yeah, it has a lot of current up in there. Yeah, as you can see, I was just editing the video, but uh, I think that's gonna be it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you haven't already, join the family, hit that subscribe button, and so you get notified every time I do upload a video, go ahead and turn on your post notification bell. But, uh, yeah, that's the end of the video. Yeah, as always, peace out and stay wavy. for this video so this is gonna be my blooper <laughs>